how to connect MailChimp to WordPress. Hi guys, welcome back. Today I'm giving you a MailChimp and WordPress tutorial on how to connect your MailChimp to your WordPress really easily and I will show you everything you need to know. So let's get started. First of all, what you will do is you will go to your WordPress website and you will open up the main dashboard. So this is my admin right here on WordPress and I have a WordPress website. You will also require a WordPress website first and then you can go to MailChimp.com. What is MailChimp? MailChimp is an email marketing platform that allows you to create emails, build your email list and create email marketing campaigns. It's one of the very famous email marketing platform out there and has all the right features and tools we need. So if you do not have an account on MailChimp, go ahead and create an account. There is also a free version available and you can just sign up uh, with your Google account or your email address. So once you have your account on MailChimp, you can see this is my dashboard and I also have my own admin on WordPress. We can now connect these two platforms so that I can do email marketing campaigns and create professional emails, build my email list for my WordPress website using MailChimp. So on WordPress, what we can do is we can go to plugins. So just scroll down and go to plugins and go to add new. And then we're going to search for MailChimp. And this is the first result that we get. MailChimp for WooCommerce. It works with our store really well. So if you have a WooCommerce store on WordPress, you can see I have one. So it will really help us to actually track our sales, create targeting emails, send abandoned cart email and more. So that is why we need to connect our MailChimp to our WordPress. So you can see it has 700 thousand active installations and is compatible with my wordpress version so i'm gonna click on install now and then click on activate and here we have mailchimp for woocommerce on our wordpress website now it says connect account i'm gonna click on it because i already have an account as i showed you and we're gonna enter our username and password click on login all right we're gonna allow you know for our mailchimp to connect to wordpress and it will be connected you can also sync your MailChimp to your WordPress so that the already created email and the email list that you already have will be added to your WordPress. So now we have MailChimp for WordPress and this is how we do it. It's so easy to do guys. And now I have connected my MailChimp to my WordPress. I have an overview. I have my own store. I have audience, logs and settings. Now you might be wondering that how and where you will be creating your email because i do not see an option here to create an email so for that you will just open up your mailchimp because now everything i do on mailchimp will be tracked back to my wordpress you can see we have subscribers we have unsubscribed we have email list everything is right now on our wordpress so i'll just open up my mailchimp and if you do not have an idea how to use mailchimp it's really easy to use uh, we have a create option on mailchimp then we have audience campaigns automation website content studio and integration so if i go to integration on mailchimp let's actually see from here as well and get an overview that if you want to connect your wordpress to your mailchimp there is another way we can do this let's say that i have a mailchimp account and now what i can do is i can go to integrations on mailchimp and if i scroll down i will be able to find wordpress here it is and I'll click on WordPress. You can see, get it all connected. And now I will be able to connect my WordPress with my MailChimp through MailChimp as well. So this is the second way you can connect MailChimp to your WordPress. So how we can do here. So you just get your site URL. It's really easy to do. I'm going to go to my WordPress website. It's already connected, but let's, uh, you know, just do that. And I'm going to get my URL. Okay, and I'm going to add the URL. Okay, and I'm going to click on get code. And we have our own custom code. Now, what I need to do is I'll just simply go to my WordPress. I'll just copy the code. I have the code now. 
I'll go to WordPress. We'll just go to the coding section. Now, this involves a little bit of coding, not the coding that we're doing it ourselves, but it's a simple copy and paste. But I know a lot of people, you know, uh, get a little worried when it comes to coding. They hear the word coding and they're like, oh my God, this is so difficult. But it's not. You just, you know, copy this code and you're going to go to your WordPress. And in WordPress, where we get the coding uh, for our theme, uh, we can just go to our website and if i go to appearance in themes we get the coding so in themes you will go to the coding and you will just select the coding section and add the code there and you will be able to connect your mailchimp to your wordpress this is the second way to do so doing through plugin is also really easy and you can see we just did that you have two ways to connect mailchimp to your wordpress it's going to be from wordpress and then from mailchimp so now we have connected you can click on create option right here and it will take you to your email i'm going to create a regular email for you guys click on design email and then we have to enter a name let's go ahead and call it like test email for our mailchimp and wordpress integration we can also edit the name and i'm gonna call it test click on save and this is the name of my uh you know email that i'm creating after that we have to where i will add my recipients from where i will add my my details subject so to add a subject just click on subject and you will add like a line let's just call it test again and i'm just gonna click on save and then we have content. So this is where we design our email. I'm going to click on design and it will open up the editor for me. I'm going to go with the classic builder. And there are a lot of templates as well available on MailChimp. So it helps us save time and create high quality emails. I am going with simple sell a product one. So this is how you create an email on MailChimp. Uh, we have our logo, we have text, and it's a simple drag and drop. So you can just drag any of the different elements, for example, text, and you will drop it right here. It will be added. Similarly, I can add dividers. Uh, when it comes to text, we have all of these different options. You can edit the text, you can upload images and videos. When it comes to buttons, we can create buttons and add links to it. Uh, we can link our pages, our products directly to our email. When it comes to style, we have page, header, body, footer, mobile style and referral badge. We can also add comments. So it's a simple drag and drop editor that we get on MailChimp and it helps us create email marketing campaigns we can create professional and regular emails and then we can also create a website with MailChimp once you're done you're gonna click on continue and send your email once I send an email it will be updated on my WordPress as well because my MailChimp is connected to my WordPress and I am actually keeping track and actually you know getting my audience from MailChimp I am growing my WooCommerce using MailChimp which is an email marketing platform and it's really easy to use and now we know how to connect our MailChimp to our WordPress. I hope that I was a big help to you guys. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up, leave a comment down below, turn on bell notification and subscribe to the YouTube channel.